Welcome to another edition of Coach's Corner presented by Conditioned Air. Mike Kelly joined by Brad Ralph, the head coach of the Florida Everblades. And the Blades coming off a real impressive weekend again last weekend, taking five of a possible six points in Atlanta. The Road Warriors of the Everblades continue and really a lot of success there, Coach. Yeah, Mike, it was a, it was a difficult week. Uh, four games in five, well, four games in four and a half days with travel in between. Uh, the guys came to play on the road. We played uh, extremely well. Um, you know, to pick up a, a point on that last game on Sunday was huge for us. We scored with, uh, you know, 1.1 seconds on the clock. So uh, just to tie it up and to push it in overtime. But yeah, hats off to our players. You know, uh, we're working hard at home and we're working equally hard on the road. It just seems like the points are coming a le- little easier on the road this year. Some transactions this week, and one certainly uh, jumped off the page. A two-time Stanley Cup champion defenseman Trevor Daly joining the Everblades. How did that come about? Well, we're we're you know like most of the the country right now, we're we're having our battles with COVID right now. Uh, we have three staff members, myself included, uh, three players out with COVID right now. Um, you know, luckily it's it's you know the symptoms. It's been a mild flu-like symptom for all of us. Um, so it hasn't kept us down for too long. Um, but yeah, we've been, you know, we've all been working extremely hard to, uh, you know, field a a good roster, a winning roster. And, um, you know, Trevor Daly's guy that lives down here, he's a, he's a well-known NHL hockey player. that has got two Stanley cups under his belt. So he was, uh, you know, I spoke to the guys earlier today and we just have an awesome hockey community here. We have, you know, when we needed some help, we have so many guys that have stepped in to help us out. And it's just been it's just been really cool to see, um, you know, these guys are doing it. They're really gaining nothing of, um, of value, whether it's monetary or, you know, what I mean, like they're just doing it just because they want to help. Uh, so it's been really cool to see guys like Trevor Daly, Ernie Hartley, Greg Paws. Um, you know, Derek Simonelli, Matt Harrington, Ben Myers, uh, all these guys just step in and, and help us out. So it's been uh, really nice to know that we have that kind of support in our community. That's fantastic. You're also getting some support from Milwaukee. The three guys under contract to the AHL Admirals all return this week as well. Yeah, we're getting uh, Jake McLaughlin, uh, Bobo Carpenter, and, and Xavier Bouchard back. I mean, our roster is as good as it's been all year tonight. So, um, you know, we're, we're excited to see what the guys can do. It's not going to be easy. I think we're coming, you know, we have a number of guys coming from the American league. We have a number of guys that haven't played much. We have all of our guys that have either been sick or didn't skate this week. So it's, it's going to be, a, you know, we're going to have to work twice as hard to get, uh, to where we normally are at this point. Tonight marks the first rematch of last year's Kelly cup playoffs matchup against the South Carolina stingrays. A lot of changes on both sides of the ledger. What type of a game do you expect here tonight? Yeah, that's right, Mike. We haven't seen South Carolina this year. Um, as most of us know, we do have a history with South Carolina. I'd say they're arguably our biggest rival in our division. Um, you know, they're a team that is struggling to find their way this year. Uh, they're trying to establish it through defensive style of hockey. Um, so, you know, that being said, I think we have to play to our identity uh, we have to be patient. Don't force things. Um, but, you know, we, we've got a great group of guys. I know our leaders, the guys that have been around, they're going to, uh, you know, they're going to be extra motivated to, to put the team on their back tonight. Thanks for joining us, coach. Thanks, Mike. You're welcome. That's the head coach of the Florida Everblades, Brad Ralph, and the opening face-off straight ahead here at Hertz Arena.